Are you afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? I hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to shoulder What's the this? burden? No, but I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I've made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do. No, We're okay. never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. We've arrived. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? It might give him some comfort. Well, once that's something we can agree on. Hey! Is somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. Uh, I guess you're expecting me? Is anyone here? Hello?
expect me to sit in their fancy chair. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bind beams are there as a safeguard. No, no, God damn it! Attention! Attention in the count of five. Count of four. No, no. Three. Two. One. No! Attention! Attention! Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Fifteen thousand feet. Hallelujah. Excuse me, where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. I just keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made. On this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet 
waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies in the and not railed against the Sodom beneath us, it would have been. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden, and... Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below, newly come to Columbia to be washed clean before our prophet, our founders, and our Lord? I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Let's end with this and turn around and get back on the road. Might as well get out of the Hey, I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Told you, I'm not gonna do it. Now go away, Mr. Dewitt. Mr. Dewitt. needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning she granted a sword of gold so that need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am it fills our lungs with water so they may better love the air he who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels Watch over me and lend me strength. A rebel against ignorance Shield my and mind from fear. Share with me your wisdom. By the sword and the scroll and the key. Only Amen. Providence. And that you see its divine hand at work. You discern. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. Still got a girl to find. something <laughs> good to see you. to capture Father Comstock, absolutely. The psalm stall's all right, I tell you. Says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? This Vox Populi that. Well, what does Vox Populi mean? Uh, it's Latin. It means...
at the raffle, folks. Columbia Raffle and Fair. Huh. He's strong in the sword, but a bit weak in the key of the scroll, if you get my meaning. and radical on me, John. I do not want to be some character out of I Married a Box Popular. Now, you are... Yeah, that's where they said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Why, good day to you, sir. Hello. I agree. You keep saying. If I told you a man could hoist a one ton stallion straight into the air, would you believe me? Well, friends, I am here today. You wanna let me through here, pal? Hey, streets closed for your safety, fella. They're prepping tonight's fireworks back there. There's enough TNT back there to blow Peking to kingdom come. Again. Roadblock. Better find another way around. Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself. Who amongst you has tasted the divine gift of the vicar? One swing and feats of wonderment are at the tips of your fingers. You know our prophet is fair. You know our prophet is kind. And he has asked personally. Mr. Jeremiah Fink. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. Find the devil, good sir, and young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. <laughs> Zipping around, spreading their lies and dissent. Fear not! I got just secure. Grab a shotgun and go to work. You did. Yeah. You got what it takes to keep our city safe? Good man. Now take aim and blast those evil box out of the sky. Hit enough and I'll get you a prize. <laughs> Wait. 
Have you used one yet? Oh my, no. I have. Liar. Honest. Nearly blew the windows out of my house. The advances in Hot dogs! Science. Hot dogs! Alexander Hot Dogs! Columbia's fire! Box of folks! Hear your voice from the past in the present! Say something, Sonny! What's a voxophone? What's a voxophone? Exactly that! A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. Have you seen I usually wait till think works out the kids before we can sing. The box copuli are off the loose. Who will hunt them down? Hey, you! Handy with a rifle? Looking to do your part for Columbia? Show your skill by hunting down Daisy Fitzroy and the vile members of the box copuli. Well, here's a brave fellow. Now, shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Well done, sir. Well done, sir. Fitzroy slain, you, sir, shall be richly rewarded. Step right up and see the eighth wonder of the world. He's big, he's bold, he's the amazing handyman. Only in our fair city will you see such amazing feats of technological prowess. Have you ever seen anything like it? You look so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? Come on down and see the amazing handyman. Is he mad? Is he mad? Has a pay telephone ever refused to connect you with a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. With just a whisper, they're all ears. <laughs> Press to turn machines into allies. What the hell was that? Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. <laughs> Heads. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. My, my, my. Is it that kind of sky already? When the young ones misbehave, escorts children to the Never back talk, never lie, or he'll drop you. Look at that one. He looks lost. <laughs> he looks just fine to me. Mary, you are a living, walking scandal. This little beauty? 
Yeah, the whole division got them. If we're gonna flush the Vox out of the Skyline system, then we gotta have the best. Uh, they got any openings in the group? I'd love to bust some Vox go. <laughs> Never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> all right then. The winner is number 77! Well, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! First throw! First throw, first throw! Please, please don't do this! It was me, it was all me, please, please! No. Please, what are you doing? Come on, are you gonna throw it? Or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> Oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. <laughs> we've got to do something about that. We got something for you, son of a Time bitch. To wait! <laughs> it's him! <laughs> now, where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? The false shepherd! And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show him what we got planned, boys!
God. What's going on? Simple. Why are you following me? We were already here. Why are you following us? I... Aperitif. Oh. What was that? Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point.
for her cause and her people. Blood must not be shed. What do you expect these poor Negroes to do? How they treat them. It was bound to happen. Violence is not a foregone conclusion. <gasps> Tim, the one they're after. Go. They're looking for you. Police, we're in need of your assistance. They're here! Shh. Keep your voice down.
began his terrible rampage. Trouble began almost instantly. Full of wrath and bent on harm, the anarchist maliciously wounded the
that Monument Island is off limits. You've got to go. Workmen should proceed to the island by means of the skyline. The sky, it's, uh, those things them coppers came riding in on back by the lottery. Whoa! of angels. Watch over me and lend me strength. Father Washington, hear my prayer. Need to head to the roof. Take that skyline to Monument Island. I see every sin that blackens your soul. Wounded knee, the Pinkertons, the drink, the gambler, and of course, Anna. And now, to repay a debt, you've come from my land. But not all debts can be repaid, Booker. You don't know me, pal. Prophecy is my business, Mr. DeWitt. As blood is yours. Do you know why these men will die for us? Because I have seen their future in the glory. And hence they are content. What brought you to Columbia, Booker? Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt? This will end in blood, DeWitt. Then again. It always does with you, doesn't it? It always ends in blood. You've come to lead my lamb astray, but thy crook is bent and thy path is twisted. Go back to the Sodom from which you came!
Well, I need an eye on it. Wonder where they got her locked up in this place. job at hand. This 
these jobs get worse all the time. My name is DeWitt. I'm a friend. I come to get you out get of here. Get away! Are you real? I'm real enough. He's coming. You, you've got to go. Why? You don't want to be here when he gets here. Just a minute, I'm getting dressed. I'll get you out of here. There's no way out. Trust me, I've looked. Stop it, you're, you're too impatient. That's enough. What about this? What about it? This is the way out, isn't it? What are you... Give it to me. about that.
Bring us the girl and wipe away the dead! Are you in there, the witch? What do you want with her? Anna! 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 of the living. Here, let me. I'll be fine. You almost drowned. You need to... I said I'm fine. Just... Just give, just give me a minute. Do you hear that? Oh, it's music. You go on. I just... Oh. Just need it. Okay, I, I, I won't be long. I won't be long, Mr. DeWitt. See a young girl, uh, blue skirt. No. No, but I'm without an escort. If you're looking to pass the time. You fellas seen a girl around here? Uh, blue skirt, dark hair. <laughs> Look at this one. Why don't you just sleep it off, chum? Hey, I'm looking for a young girl. <laughs> ah, who isn't, brother? Airship. That could be our ticket out of here. Everything's changed. Miss. Miss Elizabeth. Hello. Oh, this is wonderful. Well, come dance with me, Mr. Dwight. I don't dance. Come on, let's go. Why? What could be better than this? Well, how about Paris? Paris? How? I, I don't understand. How could we get there? That's where that airship's going, but if you want to stay and dance, we can... No, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go right now. <laughs> Anything like that before, have you? Each as I know, it don't Jump. smell much like Jump. that. Mr. Duet, Comstock. I've read about him. They say he can see the future. Give a man a little power. He falls in all kinds of love with himself. I don't like his look. Do you dislike the look of the prophet? Or his gaze? Can we leave now? Huh. If I fall into the water, did you no favors? I'll keep an eye out for something that might ease your pain. Mr. DeWitt, here! Bird? Or the cage? Or perhaps the bird? Nothing beats the cage. He's still again. How do you... Never mind. Look at these, they're amazing! Which one do you like more, this one or, or this? The bird is beautiful and the cage is somber, but there's really something special about it. I just can't decide. The one on the right. Are you sure? I'm sure. I love it. Surprising. I expected the cage. If you're going to be a sore loser, then I shan't do this again. No, that's just sophistry. Oh my god. My god. It has to be. Who else would do such a thing? Are you alright? It was my Why home. Why didn't the prophet foresee this? Yeah, we should get out of here. Let's go. what the prophet says. He tells us what he does. Was the He's the sword of vengeance. Make sure you have a piece of photographic identification ready for presentation. Put those arms up now. Fingers apart. Legs apart. Stand still. Now hey, hold steady. Look at this one. 
He's suspicious, if you ask me. Ah, uh, damn right, things locked. Down there, Pete. Let's go home and what are you doing? Home. You're a roguish type. What does it look like? Done. What did you learn to pick locks? Trapped in a tower with nothing but books and spare time? <laughs> you would be surprised what I know how to do. Hey, hey Mr. DeWitt! I found these silver eagles. There's a vending device over there. There might be something to bring you back to health. It's probably a good idea. Hey, hey, mister. We'd like to help you. Do I know you? Back at the lottery, you... Without you, we wouldn't have gotten away. Daisy always said somebody like you would come along. Cotton candy here. It's your cotton candy. Sorry, sir, but it'd be my pleasure to offer you a refreshment. Thank you. Why is one bathroom for colors and the other for whites? It just is. Seems like an unnecessary complication. You don't intend for me to follow you in there. It's me, Esther. Oh, no, I'm not Annabelle. Are you sure? My name is Elizabeth. Do I know you? Elizabeth? Isn't that a lovely name? <sighs> that was... odd. Last customer. Park's closing. Park's closing, everyone. Excuse yeah. me. These shoes sure could benefit from a shine. Guess I haven't paid much attention. Hey, you wanna watch out? I just swapped that. Um, have you got sauerkraut? Sauerkraut? Uh, I guess so. I'll take, um, one, please. <coughs> How much? Um, uh, one silver eagle. <laughs> All right. I don't know. I suspect he's carrying something. Hey. He's with her. Sure. Hey. Two tickets for passage to the First Lady airship. Yeah, just a minute, friend. Yeah, I have it. How do you, uh, want to proceed? In a bit of a rush, pal. Hey, mister, you're gonna get mustard uh -huh. all over your nice suit. I got it. I'll ring you back once the matter's in hand. I don't like this. Yeah, send in the bird. We're ready to execute. Excuse me, can I get some help here? Certainly, sir. Sorry about the wait! Ah! Ah! What are you doing? Get the girl! Don't get off her. of me!
Where is she? Great. you think was going to happen? Hmm? What? Do you understand the expense the people went through to keep you locked up in that tower? You think people like that are just going to let you walk away? You are an investment, and you will not be safe until you are far away from here. What now? What do they want from me? I don't know. That's the last time anyone gets the drop on me. Let me see your hand. What happened back there? It's not the last of it, is it? I don't know. There. I suppose I best get used to it. I've read a thing or two about medicine. I do my best to keep you supplied with remedies. If your roots are deeper, I'll Try to keep you on the side of the abyss. Get to the airship. Let me see if I can get that gate open by hand. Shock jockey. Who needs a power cut? Some fool's alternative to electricity. Doesn't seem to work very well. Stay close. Yes, Mr. DeWitt. Call me Booker. Oh, uh, all right. Booker. Should we head to the gondola or take a look around the boardwalk? I suppose a place like this might have much we'd find useful. Our ice cold Colombian ice cream <laughs> is a culinary marvel. Try it yourself. Hot dogs. Get them hot here. We got dogs for the boys. Aren't we the well-to-do types? Do you know why you were hired to come and get me? I imagine they were interested in meeting you. No doubt for lock-picking lessons. Why you? I never even heard of this place before I got here. Huh. I assumed Columbia was common knowledge below. Guess I got a bit behind with current events. Boys and girls, don't be a dimwit. How could you not know that? Must be something particular to Columbia. Oh, I loved those stories when I was a kid. But they are... They are a bit off. Need to 
summon the gondola to intend to reach that airship. These seem to be the controls that summon her. Shock jock. Of course it does. Where in the hell are we gonna find that? Look! Come see the future of power at the Hall of Heroes. Huh. Well, that's convenient. Gentlemen, the false shepherd is loose in the streets of our fair city. Will you suffer the shame of allowing your wives and your daughters to fall prey to his machinations? Or will you act? Act for your womenfolk. Act for your prophet. Act. Yes, me. Closed until further notice. Then there won't be a line to get in. and I can't fix. <sighs> oh, it's a bee. I, I hate these things. Jeez, oh, just kill it. No, it'll sting me. Elizabeth. I have a better idea. <sighs> what, what, what are you doing? opening a tear. Oh, shit. What is that? It's a tear. I used to open them all the time in my tower. What is a tear? It's like a, a... a window. A window to another world. Most of the time their doll is dishwater, a different colored towel or tea instead of coffee. But sometimes... sometimes I see something amazing and I pull it through. There. Good God. I don't suppose you've got an airship in there? I don't think so. But there is... There... There is something. I... Oh no! Close it. I, I'm trying! Close it! I don't really understand what I just saw back there. But it sure as hell looks like a shortcut to getting us killed. But I could help. I can handle whatever comes along. Trust me. Have it your way, I suppose. To the sky, Comstock bent his knee and saw with holy prophecy an Eden floating in the mist by man forsworn, by heaven kissed. your enemies into the air. Hold and release to create an eruptive trap. And when we strike, we will teach Cornelius Slate a lesson. Come on, He did 
Okay. On second thought, I think those tears of yours might come in handy next time we're in a scrape. Well, there has to be a tear around for me to use. I can't just pull them out of thin air. Slate? I actually know the fellow. He's still got a knack for making him. brothers and sisters was just the beginning. Zachary Comstock will hear our voice. His temples shall burn and his idols of gold will melt and run in rivulets through the streets of Columbia. Mr. DeWitt? Look, a cipher. A secret message from the Vox Populi. Well, you're the junior codebreaker. What's it say? Don't know. There should be a codebook somewhere. Sniper rifle. I found ammo. Got what it takes. Booker sniper. Find that shock jock and get the hell out of here.
land for God and sweetest fatherland. But here's the place where we revere the heroes of our city dear. Our prophet, Father Comstock, commander of the 7th Cavalry. That man did not lead the 7th. Hell, I don't even remember the guy. Corporal DeWitt proved his worth on the field that day. Well, I'll be. Slate? Is that you? You've always been different, haven't you, Booker? You crave no glory. Look, I see you're caught up in some kind of jam here. If you could see fit to let us through to where they keep the shock jockey, then we'll- That tin soldier, Comstock, wants my boy's dead. We won't die at his hands. There's going to be trouble. All my men have left is a choice. Die at the hands of a tin soldier, or a real one! Just give us the shock jockey. If you want the vigor, Booker, you will give my men a soldier's death. They wait for you with wounded knee and Peaky. Perfect. I'll try to keep you stocked with both bandages and ammo, but... The right materials aren't always at hand. What is this? It's the Boxer Rebellion. What happened there? In Peking, it was my hand that put the city to the torch. Of course, that's not how Comstock tells it. Was yellow skin and slanted eyes that did betray us with their lies until they crossed the righteous path of our prophet's holy wrath. Oh, I read about this. Comstock led the Colombian troops to Peking. Comstock wasn't there! The boxers took my eye and 30 of my friends! Is there even a stone to mark that sacrifice? Slate, just give me what I need. I will. After you do the same for me. Come and look for me amongst the ghost dancers. Who are the ghost dancers? Wounded knee. He means us to head to the other display. Can you hear Comstock's tin soldiers coming to silence us? But we are the true patriots. The history that does not fit in their books. The tin soldier is taking credit for the deeds of the real ones. Now your companion, young lady, he wrapped himself in glory on December 29, 1890. What does he mean? He don't know. With 
hue and cry with hatchet red. They danced amongst our noble dead. But when our soldiers took the field, the savage horde could only yield. You... you were there. That wounded knee. I can see it in your face. Tell her, Booker! Tell her how we strode that battlefield like the heroes of Sparta! I still hear the screams. Let's come, stop. After him! Here's the soldier I spoke of! The kind of man who stop pretends to be! See if I told you true! For this, I have no quarrel with these men. Heroes never ask. I never claim to be no hero. And what are you? If you take away all the parts of Booker DeWitt you tried to erase, what's left? Come back to the rotunda. It's almost over. What did Slate mean? Why did you try to erase? Now that you're out of yours, you might realize cages have their advantages. A choice is better than none, Mr. DeWitt. No matter what the outcome. Yeah. What if you woke up one day and realized you didn't like what you chose? I've got what you need, Booker. You will find me past the First Lady's memorial. lay in the womb of Our Lady but for a single week. Comstock had a child. My books never mention anything about a child. That's quite an omission. Can't imagine that was by accident. But the child took ill, and Our Lady prayed for the Prophet's heir day and night. Fitzroy has murdered my beloved. She shall not have the child. She shall not come betwixt her and prophecy. The seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. Your Comstock's daughter. No, I can't be. I, I can't. He wants you to follow in his footsteps. Well, I want a puppy, but that doesn't mean I'm going to get one. Take a look at this lock. Get through these bars, but you're too broad. Let me scout ahead, see if there's some way to move forward. Is that? It's a tear, something I can bring into this world. It's a freight hook. Well, that's convenient. As I said, it's a form of wish fulfillment. Elizabeth! There. I feel there's more where that came from. I'd get anxious, tears have a way of appearing. 
Booker, do you see those tears? We can use them against Slate's men. That tear will get us access to higher ground. And that one will give us a turret. And some cover. Try that one! Turret, now! Go! That's enough, Slate. We just do the bigger to get out of Columbia. We're taking it one way or another. Slate! More money. Keep your eye open for that shot, Chucky. the sky, Comstock bent his knee, and saw with holy prophecy, and too rare is the man who takes a stand, you and saw I, that sweetest fatherland, was here the place where we revere, with the heroes of our city. Tin men, Booker. That's what Comstock will turn us into. Wires and gears to replace heads and hearts. Take long at all. All done. Think you can pick this? I'll see what I can do. Done. The whole place is ransacked. There ain't no shock jockey here. Slate must have taken them. Look. Satisfy him. Oh no. He won't rest until he's turned us into tin. I won't let him. He took my past. But that's all he's getting from me. Just give us the vigor. We don't need to do this. Here you go, boys. A soldier's death awaits.
on your plate! Finish it! You're a tin man now! A tin man! Electricity. Hold and release to create a shocking trap. You wasn't my Comstock's men will surely take it. Do you ever get used to it? The killing. Faster than you can imagine. You know, those rivers seem very powerful. I'll do what I can to keep you stocked in salts. Thanks. What Slate said bothered you. You showed me. Sometimes you have to do what's necessary to survive. There's survival, and then there's finding pleasure in the act. Booker. Look, you seem like a decent enough sort. That said, the less you know about me, the better.
Wit. The name's Booker. I'll be certain to attend to that distinction. Booker, when there's a moment when we're not being shot at. If you're interested, I've spotted some supplies over there. I read literature on physics and other such things. Yeah? And what did that teach you? That there's a world of difference between what we see and what is.
Muffins! Here! That'll do! Reap what you sow! Conscious on the beach, you kept repeating a woman's name. Anna. I don't want to talk about that. I, I, I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have pried. Where are you from, Mr. DeWitt? New York. What did you do there? Business much like this. Something about the cave is right. It was a fine thing you came along when you did. <laughs> How do you think I ended up here? I gambled, and now I owe money to men you don't want to be in debt to. I come here to pay it back. Me busting you out. What do you think that was? Charity? Who sent you? Somebody who was willing to take my marker in exchange for you. Like they call you the false shepherd. And you the lamb. Let's not call each other that. Suits me. How do you figure they'd know you'd be coming? Either they've got a prophet on their side. Har har. Or them that hired me also wrote the signs. Why? Got me. <laughs> Feel better already. No one... Wait, what is that? 40 North by 74 West. That's not Paris, that's New York. How did you know that? One thing I had in that tower was time, Mr. DeWitt. Time to study things like geography. I owed money. And there's a fellow who... He offered to wipe away my debt in exchange for you. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. Everything's gonna be okay. Will you just turn around and talk to me and we can- uh,
Daisy. Fresh air did the trick. This one's awake. So you're this false shepherd we've been hearing so much about. Caused a mess of trouble at the raffle. You Fitzroy? Nothing but. I got no quarrel with you or your Vox Populi. But this is my airship you're hanging me out of, and I got perilous need of it. Really? Because it sure look like old Comstock's airship to Listen, me. I ain't looking for a fight. There's already a fight to wit. Only question is, which side you on? Comstock is the god of the white man, the rich man, the pitiless man. But if you believe in common folk, then join the Vox. If you believe in the righteous folk, then join the Vox. I just my ship. And the Vox shall give her to you. But first, you must help the Vox. Down in Finkton, there's a gunsmith who can supply weapons to our cause. Get our guns from him, and you shall have your ship back. Better find the Lisbeth before she lights up. The most common complaint I hear from the working men is that they are unhappy with their lot. Oh, why to avenge yourself, I ask? The ox cannot become a lion, and why would you want to? Who wants all those responsibilities and worry? You do your job, you eat your food, you go to sleep. Simplicity is beauty.
Hey, I'm slipping! Do not attempt to follow me, Mr. Twig! Elizabeth, I've made an arrangement to get our airship back! You can get us out of here! Yes! I just need to supply enough weapons to arm an entire uprising. And where will we get these weapons? From one of our many friends and allies? A gunsmith in Finkton should be a walk in the park. What do you say, partners? You're a liar, Mr. DeWitt. And a thug. But you're also my only means of reaching Paris. Don't get too comfortable with my company, Mr. DeWitt. You are a oh, nice some man. folks just are not satisfied with their place here at Fink Industries. But I tell you, there's a purpose for all living things. Would the pharaohs of Egypt have been able to stand at the top of their pyramids if the Israelites had not made their bricks? <laughs> Would the captains of industry have been able to run? Gunsmith? Who sent you to find this person? Daisy Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the telling. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland. Welcome to Fink Industries Recruitment. We are not looking for any help. You hear that? No help. How are we going to get into Finkton? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. Fink Industries is not recruiting at this time. Can you unlock this? Ready. Over there. The service elevator. Should take a sound effect. And get ourselves killed in the bark. I know you're there. What is on Thanks! Need money? but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. 
She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Can you help me out with this lock? I can do that. Got it. Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Maybe you should get that. Uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes. Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems... Oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Well, the man's got an ego. to me. Think, why is it that we get paid in tokens that are only good at the company store? Well, I'll tell you what, I'll be damned if I let any of you poor folk get robbed at some shady establishment. You see, the Fink company store brings you Fink products at a price designed specifically for the Fink worker. Mr. DeWitt, welcome to Finkton. You'll find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. What does Mr. Fink want with us? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why... So sorry, young miss, but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? Doesn't strike me as good news. We need a coal border here. What do you think? Fake manufacturing. Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies Starting by the clock bid. shop? 20 minutes. 15 minutes. 15 minutes now bid 14. We give me 14. 10 minutes bid now 10. We give me 9. nine. The hyena is a trickster. They live to stir up trouble. So you beware the hyena. They will leave you with naught but the sound of their laughter. Starting bid of 20 minutes. Can I get 19? 18. 18 minutes bid now, 18. 17. 17 minutes bid now, 17. 14. 14 minutes bid now, 14. 10. 10, now 10. 9 and 50. 9 and 50. Any lower now? 9 and 10. 9 and 10. 9, 9, 9. 8 and 33. I hear 8 and 33. 8 and 33. 8 and 33. We got our fitter in the green shirt. I need this job. <gasps> That's a 
perfect man, an efficient man. There's no more work today. Disperse! Disperse! No, I, I gotta work! My family's gotta eat! We need work! Work! Move work! It. Move work. it! Disperse! Disperse! <laughs> Got my Buddha. Who? The founder of Buddhism. Spent 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Someone tells me Comstock doesn't cater to idols getting worshipped at Amen. Hello? Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? What happened? Someone worked this place over. Local can stagger. You hear that? There's someone downstairs. Excuse me. Now I'm sorry to bother you. We're looking for Mr. Lin. Mr. Chen Lin? Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He... gone. Gone? They take... flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Mei Lin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? <laughs> Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Booker, we'll find it. Just leave her be. Why not Fox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? Who is Fox Squad? Cops. The kind who probably got the boot on Lin's throat asking me how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Let's figure out where this good time club is. Changed your sense of that. You're protected. Job's a job. You hear that? Music. It's coming from that tear. I never heard that song before. I don't suspect anyone's heard that song. and find Mr. Lin, and just call me Booker. Ah, do it, my boy! You know, the best kind of interview is 
Jesus, one where the applicant doesn't know he's being evaluated. <laughs> Sir, Dylan! I've watched you since the other day at the lottery. <laughs> You're a brute! And in times like this, I could use a brute! What do you want, Fink? My labor unrest is coming to it. <laughs> now, Fitzroy has got the jungle all riled up. <laughs> A man like me could have use of an old Pinkerton like you. Let's find Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. themselves. No, it's not. job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but I promise you this. I will get what I want. Booker, there's a door over here. I think that's the way down. Come on, Franny. You're a modern woman. It's 1912. It's gonna be 2012. <laughs> open child's play i used to work with folks like fink really 
was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. Back. Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. We know you can hear us. You want to say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Oh, what's that uh, smell? Throw a bucket of ice. Ain't no privies down here. We know it! Needs picking. No problem. All the people have done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this. I think they'll need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. Can you open this, Elizabeth? Let me see. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. Here you go. Find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? What the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want What from... do you see here, from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. The body's gone. It was never here. Another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia, but how? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If we go into this tear, I don't think I'll be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? Open it. Look. There's no blood. And no body. It's another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me that one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we'll find out why, I suppose. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same. All these men. I killed them. They were 
Doctor. I'm disgusting. Not in this world. Disgusting. Look at their noses. They're... They're all bleeding. I am asking you. One of one of me. What's wrong with them? They remember. Remember what? Being dead. What is going on here, Sansmark? Has my head of security you're one of them? That man that just fought. In the other worlds, he was the one who was struck up on the wall. In the other world? This whole business makes my head hurt. Machines. No tools. Let's go find that gunsmith. Maybe he's upstairs. Oh, look. The shrine. It's a figure of Comstock now. Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Excuse me, Chen Lin? Who are you? You speak up! Speak up! Can't hear you over all these machines! Very loud! I'm Booker DeWitt. Stand back! These machines very dangerous. Wait downstairs with Mrs. Lin. Uh, Daisy Fitzroy sent us. We need to talk to you about getting some weapons. Machines very dangerous. No place for stupid people. Want to lose pretty head? Mr. Lin... Downstairs! What is wrong with him? Remember him dead in that cell? Maybe in... In some way, he remembers that too. How would you reconcile that? I don't know.
my husband? Calm his troubled thoughts. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm looking for Mrs. Lin. I'm Mrs. Lin? No, I, I mean a little Chinese lady. She was... Booker, this is Mrs. Lin. They took Chen's tools. What's he got without his tools? Well, your husband is a bit out of sorts. If he could work again, maybe... If, if he could work, he'd... Mrs. Lin, can you tell me who took your husband's tools? Goddamn police. They took them and locked them up in the impound in Shantytown. She... Would having his tools back fix his mind? Who cares? We're not getting any guns if Chen Lin doesn't have his tools. Let's head to Shantytown. Did you notice? Lin had a bloody nose. Seems to be in style. This Tara. I'm not so sure it was a good idea. to midnight. to me as anyone else. Maybe Songbird knows, but he's not talking. I'm sorry. What for? I get to wear this stylish symbol to cover up my hideous You must think me some sort of freak. A 
girl who can bring dead men back to life. Whose only acquaintance is a... a giant bird creature. It must seem ridiculous. We just got dealt a bad hand. I am not going back to that tower no matter what happens. They won't stop until they have. Why? What did I do to them? You frightened them. Good. This is what they want, brothers. To keep you so hungry, you can't speak but to pay. To keep you so ignorant, These people are you like can't think of solutions think. to all your problems. Maybe Daisy's right. Maybe she should pay him back for all of this. Not before she pays us. We're here for guns and then the airship. Over there. Hit it Barely making a goddamn dent. I'm hungry, Bill. Do it. Now. There you go. Food! Out of my way! They don't give a damn if we live or I don't that. understand. Some people are treated like men, and others like animals. There's plenty of places down below where you'll find more of the same. Like it. A wounded knee. Yeah, like a wounded knee. Looker, there's the impact. We're gonna have to get through an army to get those tools. Get ready! <laughs>
putting those lock picking skills to work? Come on. Give me something challenging. Done. Are the tools. Now we just have to get them back to the box. And then we get our airship. Got a lock here. Keep a lookout. All done. Who are we really helping by getting guns for the Vox Populi? It's gonna help us. Daisy can make a change, can't she? Make things better for the people here. Sure. Sure as hell aren't gonna be able to carry all this back to the shop. God, we didn't think this all the way through. What is that? It looks like a tear. To a, another version of this room that doesn't have any tools in it. Well, if the tools aren't in there, then... Then they must be back, back at, at the, the shop. shop. Booker, if we go into this tear, I don't think there's any turning back. Are you sure you want to go now? <laughs> Well shut of this place for long. Booker, if the Vox get their weapons, there's going to be a revolution just like Les Miserables. These people are gonna have better lives. Yeah.
Daisy's moved these people. Things can change, Booker, and we can be a part of it. I don't want to be a part of it. Once we get our airship, we'll be well shut of this place. You're a hero. I remember I led the Vox. Slaving. I burned down the Hall of Heroes. Look. The memories. Look, come place. back to me. We're going to find Daisy Fitzroy. Let's go. delivering a tornado blow. Hold and release to build up a more devastating tornado blow. brought us to a world where the Vox had weapons. Or I created one.
this is, this is not what I meant to have happen. Elizabeth. They're dead. Come on. Let's leave this place. Let's go to the factory and get our airship. This isn't our responsibility. None of it. We just opened a door to this world and we stepped through. Are you sure, Booker? Did I just bring us to a world where Chenlin was alive? Or, or did I create it? I told you I always thought that my little trick was a form of wish fulfillment. I got my wish. Someone takes that airship out. He sees us as violent and hateful. We are lucky. We love him. We've sabotaged the engine to bring this thing down. Elevator up. That at least to Fink's office. Just right for each other, aren't they? Who? That's Roy and Comstock. Madeline, Miss 
Dr. Lin. My God, I, I was so set on getting to Paris. I, I didn't really think that... You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If, if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You, you just complicate the narrative. Oh, my God. 
no, no! She's going to kill that child. Okay, we have to do something. We have to act. We have to get in there. Come on, Booker, we've we got to get out of here. Boots me up. Go to the window and distract Daisy. Go! Is this it? Is this your movement, Daisy? This is what needs to be done. You see, the founders ain't nothing but weeds. Cut them down and they just grow back. If you want to get rid of the weed, you've got to pull it up from the roof. Elizabeth. I guess it runs in the family. Elizabeth. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, easy. This is all I had. Listen. How do you do it? How do I do what? Forget. How do you wash away the things that you've done? You don't. You just learn to live with it. So the moment of truth between us. New York or Paris? Shit. Come on, we gotta find a way to make this thing go faster. There's gotta be some sort of some sort of throttle or accelerator. Do you know something. what that looks like? I don't know. Help me find it! Elizabeth! No, that's the E. No, yeah. that is certainly it. No, it's not. It is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Is. Try again. No, you try. Fine. Stop it! Fine. Stop it! You don't Here know you what are. you're doing! Ha! Huh. There it is. No. You've done it now. He's, he's coming back. He's coming back. The notes were correct. The instrument was not. One needs both to get his attention. But if you know how to sing to him... He will take you where you need to go. Who are you? We are where we are needed. And needed where we are. So Comstock uses these songs. Are there others we can use? Something to keep the bird off our back? Perhaps you should ask the maestro himself. So where is he? <sighs> of course. Well, at least they left the piano. <sighs> That's Comstock House. We're gonna find him. We should start there. The boats are coming! We need to leave the dock! Where are these people going? We need to push going? off immediately! The, the boats are coming! Right. The barge is in full weight! We're taking Dude. off now! This is all right! Oh, 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 oh,
perfect. It's easy enough. What is it about that song that brings in the bird? It always has. When I was younger, I used to be excited when I heard it. Excited? He was all I had. He fed me. Brought me books. He was my friend. Friend? Until I grew up. And I hated him. Because he was my warden. But he's just Comstock's pet, isn't he? Just like me. It's done. Look at this. That's why no better than Comstock. Was she? Uh, once people get their blood up, it ain't easy to settle it down again. This is on our hands, isn't it? Suspended in space-time at a fixed height. So, not giant balloons? But the thing is, my book said they disappeared several years ago. I told you they'd come. No, you didn't. Right. I was going to tell you they'd come. But you didn't. But I don't. Are you sure that's right? Something tells me they're not exactly what they appear. I was going to have told you they'd come? No. The subjunctive? That's not the subjunctive. I don't think this syntax has been invented yet. It would have had to have had been. Had to have had been. That can't be right. They seem to want to help. They seem to be out of their minds. Odd, isn't it? What's odd? The fact that we sometimes... Finish each other's sentences? Exactly. It would be odder if we didn't. <laughs> How do you suppose they manage that? I'll get back to you after I figure out the floating city bit. Come on. Comstock House is up ahead. The seed of the prophet shall sit the throne. He was grooming me. Was <laughs> Thought they'd stay on top forever. Ha! Look at him now! who could hear the sound of my voice. These are dire times and I could ever so use your aid. I, I hope no one has forgotten me. Uh, Want to take here. a look at this? No problem. Uh, now back to the music. Ready. Come on. 
homes are ours! You lie! <laughs> Picking. Look at the whirl. Done. Don't give okay. any like Go that. ahead. There you go. said most fools keep the combination no more than 20 feet away. Let's hope we find one of those fools. This might be it. Why are you so keen on lock picking and code breaking? If you put a person in a cage, they develop an interest in such things. I suppose so. And I won't be locked up again. Stop him. No. That is an oath you cannot keep. But promise me that if it comes to it, you will not let him take me back. It won't come to that. All right?
Appreciate it.
Beyond that gate lies Comstock House. Lady Comstock, how lovely to see you! Wonderful of you to make the journey, especially considering your painful death 19 years ago. Lady Comstock. The dress. The thing has mistaken me for my mother. Your fingerprints do not seem to be your own today, Lady Comstock. Are you unwell? This isn't going to work. I think it can. Your mother's dead, Elizabeth. Yes. I think it's time I paid my respects. Let's head to where she's buried. There's the graveyard where my mother's buried. Going. Come on. What are we looking for? There it is. Elizabeth! Beth! It's your mother's grave. They have her preserved in an airtight chamber. Fingerprints will get us into Comstock House. She's your mother. A mother who abandons their child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door or do I have to go in with that? Elizabeth. It's her. How are you, mother? All locked up in there, huh? Looks like you and I have some common ground. Let me do it. No. Let me do it. You see, child? You chose to follow a false shepherd, and he has led you astray. Elizabeth, are you all right? No, but where, where did she Just go? Hold on, you need to rest for a minute. No, I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth, why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He, he used me to, to power that device. He opened you up some shit. Oh, She alive or dead? Why do you ask what? When the delicious question is when. The only difference between past and present is semantics. Lives, lived, will live. Dies, died, will die. If we could perceive time as it truly was, what reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all, Lady Comstock exists across time. She is both alive and dead. She perceives being both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Perception without comprehension is a dangerous combination. Look. Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her. Convince her to open the gate to Comstock House.
It's a shame you have need of her to enter Comstock House. Frankly, she doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Hmm. Lady Comstock. Yeah, I noticed. No, you'll understand. She, she doesn't belong here. I brought something through. I'm just... I'm not so sure it was her. No problem. All yours.
some money. Want it? Cipher written on the stationery. Catch, Mr. DeWitt. Taylor's. Maybe that's where the code book is. Fifty percent. What's that? Fifty percent of everything people earn here right to Comstock as a tie. I gotta get me a job in the profit business. Lock. 
at her and at my father. I think she's her, but she's also partly me. I'm not even sure I understand it myself.
now. Anyone who knew the truth. Better dead than I'm not even his daughter. I'm just some specimen to poke to prod it. No, you are not. So listen, what you've been through, ain't nobody in the world deserves that. Okay. We can get out of here, you got it. You're never gonna have to look at it. I know you hate me for not being your daughter, and I hated you for not being my mother.
I just want to see the girl.
Child, would you like to pray with me? You're hurting me. Please just let me go. We're going to cure you. I'm not sick. Your spirit is. All I ever wanted is to see you live up to your potential. I'm Dr. Pettifog, Elizabeth, and I'll be taking care of you. Get away from me. Defiant, even after all this time. DeWitt just left you here. You need to give up on him, love. He will come. needs to be destroyed. We couldn't even hold her in that tower, and now the Prophet... Destroy the lamb? His hair? If we modify the procedure, we could... It would be safer for everyone. It would seem an accident. science will cure her of. The other affliction is of a spiritual nature. What affliction is that? Hope. Your surgery is tomorrow, you know. You better eat. You still expect a wit to burst in and rescue you, don't you? It's been six months. Six months.
end. He abandoned me to serve his own needs. But in some ways, I thank him. He showed me exactly how much faith our species deserved. God put his faith in men once, too. It seems that we have something in common. Disappointment. I did not always love the prophet. There's the switch. Truth, I regret. Should be able to head downstairs and get to Elizabeth now. We've got it pinned! When the delicious question is when. Lives, lived, will live. Dies, died, will die. As you can see, Booker, the lunatics are running the asylum. They don't even listen to me anymore. All I can do is watch as what I set into motion slides into its terminal stage. It took all I had left in me just to bring you here. Uh, Elizabeth, I, I don't understand. I heard you screaming. I was, I was coming to get you. Are we... Here. Take my hand. The seed of the Prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. Say what you will about Comstock. He was a hell of a fortune teller. It wasn't the torture that broke me. It wasn't the indoctrination. It was time. Time rots everything, Booker. Even hope. I was coming. Songbird. He always stops you. Yes, but I would find a way. No. It's too late for me. I brought you here for your sake. Yours and hers. Here. 
What is this? It's for her. She'll know how to read it. What does it say? It's advice. Advice on what? How not to become me. I'm back. In 1912. Before she... There's still time. Elizabeth! Use your men upstairs. If she gets her artery, just hit her with the machines. Comstock! What are you doing to her? Let her be! Mr. Durant, what's the expression? Day late to the dollar short. If I shut down those machines from upstairs. Elizabeth, I'll be right there! I got you, it's okay. Okay, I'm gonna fix this. You ready? Just do it. Here. Help me with this. I think someone meant for you to have this. What is it? Just read it. A dream of New York happens. It's me. I. I'm the one who... Uh. She's given us a way to get past Songbird. We're gonna find an airship and we'll leave... Booker. Harris, Elizabeth. Remember, you wanted to go We're to... not leaving. We are going to find Comstock. Why? 
You saw what he turns me into. I will not allow that. And so what? You're going to kill him? <gasps> this is where you start moralizing, Booker. You forget. I know you. I'm not going to let you kill him. Really? Booker? What are you going to do to stop him? Not a damn thing. Because I'm going to do it for you. Find the prophet. Comstock Zeppelin is outside. The hand of the prophet, he calls him. When did you learn that? I've been here for a while. How long? Long enough. I hope Comstock got what he wanted from me. Because he is not gonna have long to use it. I need a lock picked. Let me have a look. Done. Does this make any sense? Everything here is a cipher that I understand except for this symbol. It's a cage. Did she say anything about this? No. Flagship. I've got to find a way on board. Stay here. I'll handle this. We are doing this together, or I'm doing it alone. Either way, I need to know the thing's been done. Oh, do it. You struggle against prophecy. Prophecy. Like a stone loosed from a slate. How thrilling to launch. How breathtaking the apex. And how terrifying the descent. As gravity drags you down into the inevitable. It's done. What's that sound? Look! Take cover! They must be duds. Those aren't duds. They're... Look around you, Elizabeth. Do it! You I bet! I built all of this for you. You are my heir, and my blood. And what has DeWitt ever done for you? To him, you are not what you always were. The means to an end is to an end.
Rocket Booker! Skylines all over the surface of the flagship. They're covered with those motorized Patriot pods. Well, that must be where they're deployed from. I wouldn't go near those lines while those pods are in place. Open it! Beck, Comstock is at the top of the ship. Let's head up. Look at DeWitt, child. There's something about him that you just can't put your finger on. Soon you'll understand the man I am and the man he is. No way up from here. Looks like the only way we're reaching Comstock is over the skylines. Mission plan. I have seen the seeds of fire that will prepare the Sodom below for the coming of the Lord. But it will not be I who carries that banner of the That job. Falls to you, Elizabeth. That job falls to you. Skylight is clear, Booker. 
Follow me. On one side of our land stands the false shepherd. And the other? The other. The remnants of the heretical Vox Populus. Which one of you men will not gladly go to his reward to see her safely to her destiny? Rejoice! Rejoice! Death has no stake! Do it! On it. There's the launch panel. Let's get those pods off the lines. Book a flat cannon! So much more. Why are they dropping so slowly? I don't know. We have to wait down. That's one corner of the pod's objective. That's all? Take care of this on my own. No, I'm going with you.
You've come to wipe your slate clean, false shepherd. But time will walk backwards before you find redemption. Some sins can't be forgiven. my tower. What's this? A siphon. I saw this there. I could hear you singing from above. Then the machine came to life in response. And then in my mother's grave, there was a smaller one. They were draining me. M maybe that's why I can't... Can't what? When I was little, I used to be able not just to open tears, but I could create new ones. To anywhere I wanted to go. But in the tower... Yes, I'll be right with you. Stand back. I'm ending this. Booker, no. This is between me and him. You are walking into a trap. I need to do this. Come here, child. Oh, come on, I don't bite. My, oh my, how you have grown. Tell me, what am I? Look at you, child. You're hey, a mess. Hey, let go of her. Elizabeth, everything I've done, I've done to keep you safe. Safe from what? The seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. But the archangel revealed something else. Beware, prophet. Beware the false shepherd Booker DeWitt, for he shall be as a wall between her and destiny. Why? DeWitt, I'm a fool. I've set mighty armies to stop you. I've rained fire on you from above. I did all of that to keep you from her when all I needed was to tell her the truth. Ask him, child. Ask him what happened to your finger. Ask DeWitt. Let go of me. Ask him. Ask the false shepherd. She's your daughter, you son of a bitch. And you abandoned her. Was it worth it? Huh? Did you get what you wanted? Booker. Tell me! Booker! Tell me! It is finished. <laughs> Nothing is finished! Booker! You lock her up for her whole life! Booker! You cut off her finger and you put it on me! Booker, you... stop it! You killed him. What did he mean? Huh? You tell me, what did he mean about my finger? I don't know. Yeah, I... I just assumed you were born with that. I, I don't know. Your nose. It's bleeding. What? Elizabeth, I swear to you. I have no idea what he was talking about. You do. You just can't remember it. No. I'll prove it to you. We'll destroy the siphon. The answer's behind one of your doors. You just have to open Destroy it. Destroy the siphon? It's the entire tower, Booker. How are we gonna do that? I don't know. But I'll think of something on the way. I need a lockpick.
will you do it? Will you do this for me? Just, just this one last thing. Well, go, 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 go! Booker, he'll help us. We can use him against the Vox fleet. Rockets, watch out! Tell Songbird where to go. Daisy, Fitzroy, Sam, look out! Hit the door! The box! We need this thing to make it to London Island! Uh. It's all that's left! Booker! Gunships! Get ready! They're on the barge!
Booker, come here. What? What is it? Look, you can use the songbird to bring the whole damn thing down. Destroy the siphon. And that's what you want. It's the only way we'll find the truth. Pop my finger, Comstock, everything. Tear it down. Tear it all down. Where is he? Where is he? Probably gonna regret this. City at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Ridiculous. of doors opening all at once my god they're beautiful what, the stars come on come on it's this way come on Are you going to open it? It's no good. Damn it. I thought once we were here, I, I could fully control it. I, I thought... What is that? It's a key. Where did it come from? It's always been there. I just... I just couldn't see it. Stars. They're doors. Doors to... To everywhere. All that's left is the choosing. What are all these lighthouses? Why are we... Who are... There are a million, million worlds. All different, all similar. Constants and variables. What? There's always a lighthouse. There's always a man. There's always a city. How do you know this? I can see them through the doors. You, 
Me, Columbia, Songbird. Sometimes, something's different. We have to say. Constants and variables. Yes. Look. It's us. Not exactly. We swim in different oceans, but land on the same shore. It always starts with a lighthouse. I, I don't understand. We don't need to. It'll happen all the same. Why? Because it does. Because it has. Because it will. There are so many choices. They all lead us to the same place. Where it started. No one tells me where to go. Booker. You've already been. Why were you here? Are you ready to have your past erased? Are you ready to have your sins cleansed? Are you ready to be born again? Take my hand. No. No, I don't want to. You already did, didn't you? Are you ready to be born again? I am. Do you hate your sins? I do. Do you hate your wickedness? Yes. Do you want to clean the slate, leave behind all you were before, and be born again in the blood of the yes. Lamb? Jesus, wash this man clean. Wait. Father, make him Stop born it. again. Lord, S Stop it. What no. are you doing? Do Get off me! Get off! Son! You didn't go through with it. You think a dunk in the river is going to change the things I've done? Let's get out of here. I mean, look, these doors of yours, they're, they're all tears, right? We'll open one up. Open one up to Paris. I want to be shut of all this. Not until we find Comstock. Comstock's dead! No. He was here. This way. And what of my debts? Bring us the girl? And wipe away the debt. This is the man who hired me to find you. Really? Yes. The girl for the debt. Wait, wait, no, this is wrong. What is this? There was no... There was no baby. I remember. No, there was no baby, and if there was, I sure as hell wouldn't give it over to this guy. Booker, you don't leave this room until you do. Do it. Time is running short. Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. Go ahead. No. You can wait as long as you want. Eventually, you'll give him what he wants. How do you know all this? I can see all the doors, and what's behind all the doors. And behind one of them, I see him. Comstock. What choice do I have? The debt's paid. Mr. Comstock washes you of all your sins. the girl and wipe away the debt. There was no baby. The deal was, I go to Columbia to get you. Booker, you're bleeding. Oh. I remember. But I remember. Now we've upset him. I don't expect this next bit will be much for his mood. Come on. What are we doing here? Comstock's dead. We can just... Go on with our lives. You don't need Dad? to. You mean like Chen Lin? 
like Lady Comstock? No. He is alive in a million, million worlds. It's not over because the Prophet is dead. It will only be over when he never even lived in the first place. Hey. Hey, the deal is off, you hear me? The deal is off! It's Give her back! Fine, hurry. Give her back! Fine, are you mad? Give her back, you son of a bitch! It's ready! Go! No! No, no, Shut no! Shut down the machine! No! Shut it Anna. down! Shut down Anna. the machine! No! Do it! Give me back my daughter! No! Anna? No. No. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Anna, I'm sorry. She's gone, Booker. Anna's gone. You shared this room with your regret for almost 20 years. Until one day, a man came to you, offered you a chance at redemption. A chance for us to live together. I told you it would work. We already know it works. The question is, you suppose he branded himself as some sort of penance? Mm, sure. I don't see the point. What's done is done. What's done will be done. Mm. I suppose the brand is his hair shirt, as he is ours. Wipe away the death. He was third. Wipe away the death. See? He's starting to put his story together. You're quite fond of this theory of yours. He's manufacturing new memories from his own. Well, the brain adapts. I should know. I lived it. Booker, wake up. Booker, wake up. This is where it started. I saw you. I saw you. To your credit, you did try to weasel out of the deal. This is all Comstock's fault. What if I went back? Killed him before he did any of this? Things get set in motion. How would one know how far back to go? That's the only way to do it. Go back to when he was born. And I'll smother the son of a bitch in his crib. Again. Why are we are back here? Ready? This isn't the same place, Booker. Of course it is. I remember. Wait. Are you ready to leave behind all You're that not... has gone before? Wipe the You're slate not... clean. Who are you? You chose to walk away, but in other oceans, you didn't. You took the baptism. You, you were born again as a different man. It all has to end. To have never started. Not just in this world, but in all of ours. Smother him in the crab. Smother, 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 smother. Before the choice is made. Before you are reborn. And what name shall you take, my son? He's Zachary Comstock. He's Booker DeWitt. No. They're both.
Anna? Anna? Is that you?